Hey guys, welcome back to your YouTube channel. Today's just a on Biola Bio and Bimbo Akintola. Now you wonder how these two got into the same gist. Yes, we all know they are both colleagues in the Nollywood industry, but that aside, a user on social media called out Bimbo Akintola calling her old and telling her that she should get married or even if she doesn't want to get married she should do surrogates like biola bayo this has nothing to do with biola bayo but she was tagged in this comment and that was why biola bayo shared this post on her social media saying whatever this is this person must be wicked the irony of all of this is women who are supposed to be supporting women are the ones who are always calling other women out recalling that biola bayo herself shared that she was called several name she was trolled on social media saying she's barren and that her husband is so dumb to have married her and how is she going to have kids but to the glory of god she shared a surrogacy journey on social media saying this is what she had to finally do to have a child of her own this bold move of biola bio encourage a lot of women they found the encouragement they've been looking for they found the voice they all have been looking for and they prayed for her and they're happy with her even though biola bio went through surrogacy she still received so many backlash after she posted pictures of her baby continuously some people were still telling her how she ought to handle a child's identity on social media now it is bimbo akintola that they've bounced on this user entering on that bimbo akintola's post and calling her out saying she ought to be married and if she doesn't even want to get married or have children she should to surrogates like Biola Bio, and this happened to be on Bimbo Akintola's birthday. Actually, there was what the user said. The user said, "At Bimbo Akintola, from 18 years to 50 years, you do younger. Very picky on man, cause you think you are beautiful. I can speak good English, and you let all this fancy rubbish make you empty till you have no child, no husband, auntie." Go for surrogate. Let someone carry a baby for you like at Biola by one so that you will not leave this world empty. What was the cruel message posted by this user on social media? On seeing this, here was what Biola said, commenting to the post. She said, why are people this wicked? I can't even comprehend this. How do you leave this kind of comment on at Bimbo's at, at Bimbo Akitola page and tag me? What is all this? You are evil. How do you reason? On seeing this, a lot of people in the comment section of Biola Bio had different opinions. Some people said she needed not to have posted or reposted this comment because it gave it more relevance, as a lot of people wouldn't have even noticed who this person is or what the person said. But Biola Bio, in our own defense, said she had to post this because she was actually tagged in the comments hence why she has to respond but for being back it all as expected she had nothing to say to this she didn't even pay any attention or give any heed to the comment well in my opinion no one should come for me i think biola bio could have messaged being back into her personally letting her know that she's actually sorry and she has nothing to do with this post and whoever decided to tag her and just leave the matter to rest well of course on the other hand some people have gone ahead to report the page of this user and of course it has been brought down and people also share their own peace of mind about this user as well. Being back in Tala on the other hand, I said severally that it's not that she doesn't want to get married, but she has not found the right person yet. Being back in Tala was asked severally why she was not married, why she's yet to be married, qualities she looked forward in men. She said a lot of people get her wrong and she didn't say she doesn't need a man. She's just saying she's yet to find that person. In our words, she said, of course I do. Like every human being on earth, I do. Marriage is such a huge step. It's deep. Marriage is the relationship that is most difficult of all relationships. If I can't see someone and say, oh yeah, I want to be with this person for the rest of my life or even think it, I won't do it. I say that all the time and people say, oh my God, she said she would not marry. I can't believe it. That is not what I'm saying. I'm simply saying if I don't see someone that I believe I can look out for for the rest of my life, I won't do it. Someone that has principal integrity, someone that is kind, funny, and very clean. You see, it's not about being tall, dark, handsome, and having money. 
we can work it out together or whatever. My mom did marry my father, a rich man, so I don't put much emphasis on money. It's not about money or looks. It's about your heart and your head. So for me, I have to be in my man's heart and in his head as well, intellect and, you know, human feelings. This was Bimbo Akitela years back sharing our thoughts on marriage and changing the narrative being spread about her and the things she thinks about marriage. Well, some people have also considered her a feminist, but she made this clear that she is not a feminist and she would never be part of it. She said she believes in human rights, humanitarian acts, and not just fight for the girl child, fight for every child because they all matter. And she's not part of those who push the narrative of feminism as it is toxic. And she can never be a part of that. In our words, she said, my passion for the girl child and the women does not make me a feminist. I'm a humanist. I don't like this feminist idea because I think there's a focus on this wing of feminism that is extreme. It is toxic. I don't want to be part of that. I want to realize that you care about human. If you say you are a humanist, that means every individual, boy, girl, woman, man, everybody. My niche is the women and the girl child because there's so much to do concerning this issue in Nigeria. This was Bimbo Akintola sharing this. And speaking more on marriage, said a lot of people misquote her and she never said she doesn't want a man. She said in her words, people like to misquote someone. I will repeat it. Marriage is important. It is very serious institution. We go to church, you call your parents for those that watch you grow. And you say, this is a man you want to be with for the rest of your life. Now, if I can't find that man that I want to be with for the rest of my life, I would rather stay single. Nothing is wrong with doing that. Thinking more about marriage and having to always clear herself about what she has to say about marriage and finding the right man. She said, marriage is a bigger work. Once you have signed the paper, you are in each other's space, day in, day out. You are two people with different backgrounds. You have problems until you have even grounds. So it takes a lot of hard work to stay in marriage. That is why when my friends come to me and say, I am getting married, I ask, are you sure? I've never dated any person and said, oh, this is the person I want to marry. This was Bimbo sharing our own side of the story. And here, once again, someone in social media decided to troll her saying that she's old, she's now 50, she doesn't have a child of her own, she doesn't even have her own husband. And suggested to Bimbo saying she should do surrogacy just like Viola Bayo did. Well, guys, what's your opinion on this? Let's hear it in the comment section. Do not forget to like, subscribe, and drop a comment in the comment section below. Thank you. Bye.